formed part of the university together, and now they've been able to graduate together. With friends and family there for the big day, students in seven different subjects saw the end result of all their hard work. The event was chaired by Chancellor of the University, Sir Lindsay Hoyle. They've been here all the time together and now they actually finished together and I think that's the most amazing part for me. Meeting the families I think is also the other side isn't it? Proud families, are there, here, want to support the people who's graduated and I just being part of that is also, it's wonderful then, but I've got to say it's wonderful for me as well. 21 future teachers completed their postgraduate certificates in education or PGCEs. Bachelors, masters and doctorates were also awarded in subjects including business administration, leadership and management and marine science and climate change. Ahead of the ceremony, students from countries including the UK, Italy and Mexico told us a little about their work. My topic is um, octopus, so I basically put um, artificial dens for octopus uh, in the ocean to try and give them more places to live so that their numbers increase. The octopus um, went and made home in the pots um, and we even saw the mating in the pots so hopefully they'll use them for breeding and yeah it was successful. I have been designing a tool which actually makes conservation easier for, um, for governments like that to make sure that marine science, uh, marine conservation is easier and more cost effective to carry out so it's better in the long run. In the entrance of the, of the bay and where the strait is, I thought there was going to be more biodiversity uh, but it's less than in Seven Sisters so uh, I think that it might be the, the fishing pressure that it's uh, fishing uh, a lot of the, of the main uh, fish that are living in the reef. So I think that everybody knows that the Bay of Gibraltar is uh, the home of three species of dolphins, but actually these dolphins face a lot of risks, and one of it is uh, the recreational fishing. So what I did is to, um, is was to, is to assess the impact of recreational fishing on dolphins. It's a really proud moment in terms of seeing and they're on academic academic journey and just to see them finish and you can see the the delight on their faces not just that they're finished but in terms of the impact of the work that they have had both locally and internationally we've always said it you know where Gibraltar lies it's, it's a hotbed of biodiversity and we've got this year you know projects from marine bacteria all the way up to cetaceans and everything in between it really is saying this is Gibraltar this is the University of Gibraltar and people are getting to know it's been much of a secret that's been kept we've got to open up this best kept secret about Gibraltar and that's the university graduation now over the 75 students will choose their individual paths all, however, taking with them the knowledge and skills gained at the University of Gibraltar.